Well, the U.S. Navy's Blue Angels unit will be among the many attractions at this weekend's Sound of Speed air show at Rosecrans Memorial Airport. Some of the crew landed in St. Joseph Wednesday and took two community leaders on a ride they will never forget. Our reporter Kristen Carver, who also took a ride, was there to capture it all. St. Joseph Fire Chief Mike Dawson, as well as Meyerhofer Funeral Home and Crematory President Todd Meyerhofer took the trip of a lifetime as they flew with the U.S. Navy's Flight Demonstration Squadron Wednesday. It's been a lifelong dream of mine to be able to fly in an in a F-18 with the Blue Angels. I've been in the military. Uh, I got to sit in the cockpit of a KC-135 one time, so, but I don't think uh, this will compare. And it sure was a ride unlike any other. Yeah! The riders flew for 45 minutes in a FA-18 jet with pilot Lieutenant Andre Webb. Meyerhofer and Dossling reached about 16,000 feet and experienced up to a 7.5 G-force. The riders wore earphones and a microphone to communicate with Webb up front. Next maneuver we'll do is a roll. With the flips, turns, and spins, the community leaders sure got a taste of what it's like to be a Blue Angel. I cannot, uh, I can't, you can't say enough of what these men and women do in the military, not only in the Navy, but here at the 139th, but that piece of equipment there is, uh, it's, it's something else. Now I couldn't let Dalsling and Meyerhofer have all of the fun, so I put on my gear, strapped in, and gave the thumbs up. Ready, hit it. She did great. Uh, you know, the G and all of the sort of disorienting maneuvers uh, didn't have uh, any effect on her whatsoever. She had a great time. The entire Blue Angels squad will fly around inches from one another at around 700 miles per hour. But you will have to attend this weekend's Sound of Speed air show to see that. Reporting for News Press, now I'm Kristen Carver. Looked like she had a lot of fun. I'm not surprised she didn't pass out or anything because uh, she's a tough girl, Kristen Carver. She uh, she gets the job done, so it looks like a lot of fun.